Hey, hi, hello my friends. Welcome back to my channel. So as y'all know, we've been quarantined for a good amount of time and I'm kind of losing my mind. But the one thing that has been keeping me kind of sane and broke is online shopping. Is it fun? Yes. Is that good for my wallet? Probably not. But I've actually gotten a few good deals on a lot of stuff actually. Like Fashion Nova right now has like 80% off. This isn't sponsored by the way. But Fashion Nova, if you're trying to sponsor me. And just a few other things here and there. Mostly online shopping. I have like maybe just one item outside of online shopping. Let's just get right into this haul. Oh my god, there's literally like a fu- <sighs> Y'all are fake as fuck for not even telling me. Okay, that's better. Okay, so I want to start off with the stuff that I got from Amazon. I love Amazon Prime. My stuff gets shipped really quickly. Sometimes it'll be there the next day and I, I'm just, I'm shook. Like props to all the Amazon workers right now. And yes, I have opened and already worn some of these things, but I did put this little set on my Instagram and people were living for it. They are like, girl, where'd you get that? <laughs> Amazon. I'm gonna link all the stuff that I got down in the description below if you guys want to take a look at that But I'm actually washing the shorts right now because I'd be wearing this a lot. But yeah, I love this. It's so cute So this is the little pajama set. I am living for this like if you've seen my Instagram You know what this looks like. It's very cute. Very comfortable. I love the feel of it. Uh, I just paired it with my slippers because that's what I usually wear it with. It's not something that you would typically wear outside the house, but I guess you could if you wanted to. Um, this is just something I like to wear at home. But yeah, very cute, very comfortable, and it was at a really good price. Honestly, like, I love this. Next from Amazon, I... We have friends! Since quarantine has started, it's been kind of hard to feel good about yourself because you're sitting around bumming it out all the time and sometimes you just feel like you need like a confidence boost so i did purchase some lingerie and i just wanted to try to see like what the lingerie on amazon was about but i did see that other youtubers sometimes get lingerie on amazon and so I let me find out anyway so i picked up this one this is actually really cute. Um, the only thing it basically covers, and it's still like not fully covered because it's see-through. I'm not gonna be trying this on for y'all because that is only fans content, okay? That is exclusive. So yeah, this is really cute. It's not really like, it's just the strings and then the only thing that's covering is the lace on the booby area. I do wish that I would have sized up because it does fit a little bit small around my chichis, but Overall, it's really cute. Okay, and then my next purchase was this cute little robe. It's obviously see-through and it, it's so like, it's just, it looks so sexy. Like I'll put it on with my lingerie and I'll sip some wine and I feel like a bad bitch. I didn't realize that it came with a little banguita. And honestly, it's so cute. For my next purchase, I went to Walmart. So I had originally purchased a pair of these they're like knockoff keds the first time i ever purchased them it was like ten dollars at target and then i repurchased them again for about five dollars so that time i bought two and then i don't know what happened they're like my go-to rave shoes my go-to destroying shoes because it's so cheap but because i always ruin them and overuse them i looked them up to see if they have them at target they have them online on sale for ten dollars but shipping is five dollars so i was like mm, i'd rather just go to the store and get them and apparently there are none they are sold out in every store at least in my size so one of these days i was just at walmart just getting my essentials and i just happened to walk by the shoe section and i i was looking for my size i'm typically a size seven and i saw these and they're size six and I was like, damn, like they don't have my size. They're probably not gonna have the right size. 
but I decided to pick up the size 6 and compare it to my shoe. The sole actually matched up to my shoe sole pretty well. So I was like, alright, let's give them a shot. And they're actually kind of big on me. I had to like tie them really tight. But if you're going to get a pair from Walmart, definitely size down or two sizes down. I don't think they have a size 5, but if you find one and you're a size 7, that'll probably fit you perfectly. Sorry if I sound weird. I don't know why. Like, I'd be stumbling over my words. I, I have this stutter that comes out every now and then, and then I sound like I can't speak English, which I pretty much can't. Next up. I've actually been waiting to open this. So, I know you see the DSW packaging, but I literally just wanted some Crocs. And I am not willing to pay the full price for Crocs because that's expensive. And low key, Crocs are kind of ugly. But. I don't know, I've always wanted Crocs. Just, just to see what the hype is. Everybody says it's, they're super comfortable. So. Yes, I did get them in yellow. I know it's a very flamboyant color, but Bad Bunny was wearing like lime green Crocs, so. Fun fact about that, before quarantine started, I had to purchase a pair of work shoes because I work at a restaurant, so I need a specific pair of shoes. And I went to DSW and it was $16 for work shoes, but I did need to get them. And at the time, I didn't have a DSW account, not an account, a membership. So they asked me if I wanted one and I was just like, sure, why not? So I logged in and everything with my account information and all that. And I did have points on there, so I was able to get a 30% off discount, I believe. Maybe 40. I don't remember, but I had a pretty decent discount. And then there was an option to get $10 off and then another $10 off. And they ended up costing somewhere between like $10, $20. I don't really remember, but it was very cheap. So I definitely recommend you to get a membership on DSW. It's A1. Next up. Yes, sir. Okay. So I have been dying for these leggings. I think they're leggings, pants, joggers, I don't know. But they are the Wanderlust leggings. And I wanted them originally in gray. Unfortunately, they never have my size in gray at the times that I go look on Fashion Nova. But I found it in green and I thought it was really cute. However, I didn't get the matching sweater with it, but they feel really soft. Honestly, I want to live in them. All right, so I also picked up this tank top. It's like a, like an olive green color, and I love this color, and I thought it would be good to match the Wanderlust leggings since I couldn't find the matching sweater for it. By the way, most of the clothes I pick out are size medium. I'm typically a size medium. But I also picked up the Wanderlust sweater in black. It's a hoodie, not a sweater, but I wanted the gray one really bad, but I thought if I get the Wanderlust green leggings, maybe it'll look good with black. I had to size up to a large because they literally sold out of my size when I was in checkout. So I picked up a large because I have ordered from Fashion Nova before and I have found that certain items do shrink. I'm hoping that this shrinks. I also got this Wanderlust. It's another hoodie, but it's a short sleeve one. The other one was long sleeve. And this is in a size medium. I'm thinking that this would be what the medium sweater would fit me as. These are the green pants. They are very comfy. Like, I'm not even gonna lie to you. Like, they make my booty look kind of popping or whatever. And honestly, it's pretty versatile. I think the green looks pretty good with the gray. It would be nice if I had like a pair of gray shoes. I literally just paired it with a pair of my black low top vans. But overall, very cute. So this gray Wanderlust hoodie is like probably my favorite. The hood sticks out a lot over here. More than the black one, I would say. And like it just... Like, I don't know if y'all can see that, but it looks very cute. It's definitely got like a little booby moment going on over here, which I'm not mad at, you know, 
very cute, very sexy, and very comfortable. Okay, so next up, I have this green top. And again, I'm just matching it with the green bottoms. Honestly, this is really cute. I just feel like this is good for lounging around. It's a nice little monochromatic moment. Um, and then I really like it with the shoes too. You could even do like some white Nikes or, you know, some Keds. So this is the long sleeve Wanderlust hoodie top. Um, the hoodie is cute and everything, but I feel like the gray short sleeve one was a lot better. I don't know, that's just my preference. It had a little booby moment. This is still cute, like, it's still very wearable. It looks good with this outfit, again, with the green pants. And it's very cropped as well, as you can see. A little bit more cropped than the gray one. I think it goes really well with my bands. The sleeves are a little bit short, as you can see there, but I mean, it's not a big deal. Um, but overall, very cute, um, very comfy as well. Okay, next up, I have, so, don't ask me why, I just wanted to try something different. Wow, okay, this was, this literally only came in one size. Fashion Nova, you be playing, you think this is gonna fit me? Like, what is this going to cover, my nipples? Well, it looks cute in the picture, so I'm gonna I'm gonna base it off of that and it comes with a little faldita too Okay, y'all I Know what you're thinking. It's a little bit much honestly Yeah the, Yeah, I, I, I have nothing else to say, but I paired it with my Doc Martens um, so this set is very different from anything that I would usually buy but I do like going to festivals and I feel like I could see myself wearing this at a festival. Right now I'm just wearing like a tanga and a bandeau to like, you know, cover all the goods. But I could definitely see the crop using that as like a shirt and just having like pasties under if you're into that. The skirt, the thing is this set is one size and I don't agree with that because I mean I'm a medium to large and this just it does not no this is definitely too small i feel like i could use this as like a bandeau and put on pasties as well let me just show you the back so you guys can see the little booty area because you know i got a little tanguita going on and it looks cute it's like y'all really thought y'all really thought <laughs> Okay, and the last item from Fashion Nova was another lingerie piece. This is not really too much just lingerie. This is something you could wear to go out, except we can't go out. This would be really cute with like a pair of, oh, oh, with a pair of like high-waisted jeans. I feel like black jeans would go really well with this. Super cute, love the color. It's more of like a deep red. Okay y'all, this is my last Fashion Nova fit. And this is the top. I just paired it with the ironically also Fashion Nova jeans and these little heels. If you see the tag on there, I did not just buy them. So a year ago, I was supposed to go to this party and my friend really wanted me to go and I was getting off of work and I had no shoes to wear like I had like a backup outfit but no shoes like legit I just had my work shoes and I went to Target and I picked these up I think they're so cute but I never got to wear them because I didn't end up going so there's that okay back to the shirt so I'm not gonna show you my nipples honestly this is very wearable you just need to wear like some pasties or something because it's, I mean, it's got a little bit of a nipple moment but very cute I like the way the lace comes up over here it's very lacy over here let me show you the back it's kind of open in the back very cute very sexy I like it very much and my last bag I think I'm most excited for this one it literally just came today this is the last package that I was waiting for to do this haul video I'm so excited and I just can't hide it. So I had my first Gymshark purchase. 
for my birthday. I got it as a birthday gift. It made like it made me feel so good about myself when I was working out. It's like the most minimal thing, but I have found that I've been in a slump when it comes to fitness at the moment, and I'm usually very pumped and ready and energized whenever I go work out. But as of right now, due to quarantine, I feel like I've been very unmotivated and everything. So I wanted to purchase some more fitness gear to get me excited to get back to working out. Okay, so I picked up this sports bra slash shirt because I mean, Gymshark's leggings do come all the way, like they're like high waisted. So I could easily just throw this on as a shirt. I love the little straps on the back. This is like a pink color. It's like a, yeah, like a pinky plumish plum color. I thought it was more of a red, but it's still cute. Like on camera, it does show up like kind of red, but in person, it's more of like a magenta, but very cute. Okay, and these are the Energy Seamless Leggings in black. Black is such a basic color, I know, and I do have black leggings already, but I don't have anything high-waisted like this, and I don't know, it's just like, I was really feeling them. This little set goes really well. I really fuck with it. Um, I thought this shirt was going to be a more vibrant red, but it's more like a plum color. I'm not mad at it though. It's really cute. Um, and they're both in the same style. These leggings are everything. Like you need a staple pair of black high waist leggings. And I feel like these Gymshark ones are it. I love how this is like, like this mesh type deal, but like with like crochet style i don't know but i really like this um very very nice i feel like i could wear this outside of just working out in the gym i mean i'm we're not going to the gym but like outside of working out i could just wear this to like run to walmart i really like the fact that the logo is on the back over here oh and this is also a little bit of mesh over here it does have booby pads it's, it's literally a sports bra but you can literally as you can see i'm wearing it as a shirt and i just paired it with my nike free runs and last but not least i got these leggings so i didn't want this color to begin with but i did like the style of this i like how it contours the butt area because you know I like a good contour on the butt and then I love the fact that it has the Gymshark logo not the logo it says Gymshark on the band it does say Gymshark right here as well y'all these Gymshark leggings are everything like I love the little pink accent that it has to it this is what the back looks like I love the logo like it just I don't know not the logo, like the wording, it just looks really cool. I like that it's embroidered in there. I'm pairing it with this little halterish top. I think it's a halter top. I don't remember what it's called. Um, and then my knockoff Walmart kit. They look like legit kits. I like to use the ty these types of shoes for leg day because you need flat feet for when you squat, y'all you know I mean? So yes, I, I really like these. I like the color. It's just super cute. I love it. And that is everything for today's haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe to your girl. Let me know if you want to see more videos like this because I enjoy shopping, but I don't like going broke. But if you guys want me to go broke for the content, I will. Bye. Yeah, I know.